So here we are at the hut over at Camp Freedom 2. It is um, Thursday, May the 4th. Be with you. <laughs> <laughs> and um, our water catchment system caught some water. I actually poured a little bit out from here into the main container here, which you can see has actually got about two and a half inches of water in it. And the animals didn't dump this over yet because I suspect they got water and I know there's probably water back there. I wonder if our little creek has filled up. But um, we're planning on um, going back to uh, check out the yurt here in a moment as well as um, I'm checking out the water catchment system here. Uh, for those of you wondering what this is here for, it's to catch water for anyone using it, needing it at the camp. It can be used to put out fire, it can be used to uh, water plants, it can be used to um, do laundry. And actually, uh, pretty soon it can be used to drink. I'm in process of coming up with a water distillation system using solar power to distill the water. Um, and um, we're going to see if we can't get this water, even as gross as it looks right now, to become... Um, Pretty much pure drinking water. Uh, you can see here we got our metal uh, can here that I've left back here for now, but I'm going to be making that into a miniature rocket stove for possible use at the yurt shortly. If not, we'll use it out here or elsewhere. Um, there's some interesting upgrades coming up. Let's uh, take a look and see our bird nest and see. I wonder if the bird is still here or if it abandoned it. Actually, you know what? I see a hole in the bottom. I don't know if you can see that. Do you see the um, the nest itself? It's not just a flat nest. It's one of those house nests. Kind of like a hut. I think the bird that's making that is creating this like arch dome shape um, bird nest. Yeah, look at it. It's not a It's not a flat bird nest like I thought it would be. Or like I thought it was at first. See, look. It's got a um, little hole inside. Yeah, look at that. It's got a hole inside. Let's look inside. That means, um, whatever that bird or whatever that creature is, it's still building. So we're gonna leave it be. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try not to disturb it and let it finish building the nest and I'm gonna let it stay here. And if, um, I am going to have to clear up the hut, so hopefully I don't freak it out when I move things around. But we'll let it finish, and maybe, um, it'll have babies in there. But I'll leave it here pretty much intact and in the hut where it kind of left it. Although we're going to clean it up a little, clean things up in here a little bit, because we're going to take some of this item. Because obviously the hut is useless right now. We're going to take some of these items and move them out to the yurt. So without further ado, I think it's time for us to head on back.